こんにちは。書道家の山口良子です。これから書道のお話をします。一緒に、えー、学習しましょう。よろしくお願いします。I'm 山口良子、Japanese c a l l i g r a p h e r i introduce the digital archives of National Diet Library of Japan to you. If you have tools of Japanese calligraphy, for example, brush and ink, let's write with me. Please click on Find on the Modern Map. This map is Modern Map of Tokyo. Look at left side menu and click on the Sumidaku. This is a map of Sumidaku and click on Ryogoku Bashi Bridge. There are many plains of river scenery. Summer in Japan is very humid and hot, so people seek cool wind and walk around the riverside after eventide. It is called Yusuzumi. I selected Toto Ryogoku Yusuzumi no Zu. The fireworks display of the Sumida River was very popular. Of course, it is the same in modern Tokyo. Tou to ryogoku yusuzumi no zu. The meaning of Toto is the eastern capital. It means now Tokyo. Ryogoku is the name of here. I already explained yusuzumi. Zu Next, su is written by repetition character and sonant mark, so it seems three short slant lines. No means of in English. Zu means a picture. Sada, fusa, kaku, yama, shiro, ya, jinbe, e. Sadafusa is the name of artist. Ga or kaku means painted. Yamashiro ya jinbe is the name of publisher. Han is a shortened form of hanmoto. Hanmoto means publisher. There are a lot of other kanji in it. Please look for them. Let's write on paper.
I finished it. Every summer, many fireworks festivals are held all over Japan. But unfortunately, this year, almost all of them were cancelled for COVID-19. This year, at June 1, secret fireworks project was held at Nationwide from Hokkaido to Okinawa by over 160 professional of fireworks, only 3 minutes from 8 p.m. It was secret for a void crowd of people. I wanted to see. The origin of the fireworks is requiem. In this picture, we can find a name of God, Oyama Sikison. It is God of Mount Oyama in Isehara-shi, Kanagawa Prefecture. And we also find people, they went into river to purify their body and soul. Now, I also pray to God for the end of COVID-19 every day. See you at next movie. また次の動画でお会いしましょう。